Hello everyone. Welcome to Controllers Tech. Today, in this video, I will show you how to make a Corona display meter for your country. I am using ESP8266 and OLED display. I will also demonstrate this on LCD 16 x 2. Let's start by creating a project in Cube IDE. I am using STM32F446RE, but you can use any other controller too. First thing first, I am selecting external crystal for the clock. Select I2C for connecting the displays. We need to use the fast mode for OLED display. LCD display can work in either mode. Next, select the UART in asynchronous mode. And enable the interrupt. Next, the clock setup. I am selecting external crystal, which is 8 MHz, and I want the system to run at 100 MHz. Also I am changing these pins for convenience. Click save to generate the project. This is our main file. Let's see the connections first. This is how ESP is connected to the controller. Connect RX pin to TX, and TX to RX. Connect VCC, and CHPD to the 5 volts. And ground to ground. OLED is connected straight forward. Now we need to copy these library files. You can get them after you download the code, from the link in the description. Copy the C files in the source directory, and header files in the include directory. Now, include the functions.h file, and ssd1306.h file. If you are using any other I2C, you need to update it here. Also update the UART, if you are using any other. Let's copy this function. And we will paste it in the interrupt file. Also change the UART interrupt handler. These are all the basic setup we have used in previous videos too. Functions file only have two functions. This is to initialize the ESP. You need to enter your Wi-Fi credentials here. This function is to get the data. It requires the API key. To get it, go to thingspeak.com, and create an account. After logging into your account, go to apps, thing http. New thing http. Give some name to this. Now we have to get data from somewhere. Go to worldometer.info Select your country. Now copy this address, and paste it in the ThingSpeak URL. Leave everything as it is. Go back to Worldometer. Right click on the total cases, click inspect. Right click here, copy, copy X path. 
and paste this in the parse string. Remove the span, and click save. That's it. Now let's write the main program. Initialize the OLED display. Print some data to show the status. Initialize the ESP, and enter the Wi-Fi credentials. Clear the display. In the while loop, print some info. Now we will get the data. Copy the API key from the thing speak, and paste it here. We also need to create some arrays to save this data too. Enter the arrays to their respective positions. And now we will print this result on the OLED. This will print the total number of cases, deaths, and recovered cases. Let's build this, and flash it into the board. You can see the data being displayed. To show that it's working properly, I will change the country here. You can see the data is also updated. Let's change it again. And data is updated again. I will change this back to my country. If you are using LCD, we need to copy the LCD related files into the source and include folders. Include the i2c lcd.h file. Now, we will initialize the LCD. Print some string to display status. Initialize the ESP8266. Get data from the server, and print it on the LCD. Let's build and run this code.
The data is displaying as expected. This is it for the video guys. You can download the code from the link in the description. Be safe, and have a nice day.